When is jaw surgery necessary? Most children who have a big overjet, when there's a big space between the upper and lower jaw, are told that they will need to have surgery. And this young girl of 10 years old, her upper front teeth were 14 millimeters in front of her lower front teeth. This is a very big measure, and she was told without doubt she would need surgery. But surgery is normally delayed until the age of 18 or even later. However, there are alternate methods, and she selected to have orthotropics, which, as you may know, guides the growth of the jaws. In her case, not only was the lower jaw brought forward, but the upper jaw was taken even further forward, so that she started like this, was then put like that, and then the lower jaw was taken to there. This gives a very nice forward growth to the face, and also provides all the room for the teeth, so it is not necessary to take anything out. The, the big advantage is that if you can do it by natural growth, it tends to be stable afterwards and lasts for the rest of the patient's life. Whereas if you cut the jaws and reposition them, there is quite a big degree of relapse. About 50% of cases will relapse within 12 to 15 years. So you can understand our preference for correcting these problems with orthotropics to get that forward growth of the face, which not only gives you a better looking face, but is so much more stable.